this sounds like a cliche, but I'm just gonna say it anyway, because it's easy. Um, I think the story found me. All of the plays created by Cornerstone come from the process of story circles, where you invite people of the community. You ask them questions and they pour their heart out to you and they tell you about their world. And you take those stories, those ideas, that essence, and you create a play from that. So for Seed, it was people who were involved in agriculture. What I learned about uh, South Los Angeles urban farming in general was that it was actually going on. I had no idea that people were growing their own food in the city. You kind of drive down Florence, which is this wide urban street, and off to the corner is this store with like a huge vegetable garden. I didn't realize that there was an active culture. The general story I took from people was self-reliance and self-determination and sovereignty, that you can affect change for yourself for your community, that it doesn't have to be global. It can be in small ways that can have tremendous impact on people's lives. I think theater can affect change like this because theater's communal. It affects change by reflecting back what is going on, by creating alternative realities and alternative narratives. We can imagine a different world. And if we can do that, then we can possibly imagine it in, in the quote unquote real world. This play hopefully will push me as an artist to make better work and then also to like grow some stuff in the spring, grow some kale or something. Uh, I play the guitar, badly. I just learned Simple Man by Leonard Skinner. I can make a frittata. Here's a good one. If I wasn't a playwright, I would either be a historian or a police detective. I think a police detective, a police detective on Law and Order.